Confronted with problems in animating the true process of economy, Lyndon LaRouche began what he called the Basement Project in 2006, with the goal of animating the most crucial aspect of economics, the process of discovery which has created the technologies that have transformed human civilization over the generations. The first phase of that project was a working through of Johannes Kepler's Astronomia Nova, his New Astronomy by a team of researchers tasked with making clear how Kepler had made his discovery. It was an economic project, but not in the usual sense of economics. The purpose was to model or animate not a physical aspect of economic production, but rather the mental process, the mental production that creates economics in the first place. That team produced an animated website designed to aid those working through Kepler's book a website to accompany group work-throughs of Kepler's mental process. The website you see here is being created to supplement and possibly replace the older website, primarily by going through enough detail to make Kepler accessible directly through the site without necessarily requiring a copy of his Astronomia Nova. Here you will find a variety of things. His demonstration that his predecessors, Ptolemy, Copernicus, and Tycho Brahe had all created mathematically equivalent models, you will see the proof that the mathematical underpinnings of those models prevented them from ever accurately describing the motion of Mars. You'll see Kepler's rejection of the vicarious hypothesis, the best possible mathematical model of Mars's motion, which forced the need of founding astronomy upon physics rather than mathematics and the beginnings of his application of gravity to what he determined to be the elliptical motions of the planets. This work of Kepler's, the first work of modern science, is essential for an understanding of economics. And this wonderful journey of discovery in which we stand shoulder to shoulder with Kepler as he takes on his opponent Mars, this should be part of the basic high school curriculum in the hopes that it soon shall be so, and recognizing the urgent necessity of providing the population now with a source upon which to build their own internal history of scientific discovery, we present this website.